A change in plans for a long-awaited traffic project in Charleston County is raising concern for some people. It is. News News' Jordan Sayopa tells us about the future of the main road project. Plans to build a bike and pedestrian bridge alongside the Limehouse Bridge are no longer included in the main road segment A project. Now the nonprofit Charleston Moves is pushing to change that. Long-awaited improvements in the main road corridor are moving forward, but a change in the plans is raising concern for the nonprofit Charleston Moves. This all happened sort of last minute. I, I want to solve the problem. Katie Zimmerman is the executive director for the organization and says she learned late last week a proposed standalone bike and pedestrian bridge was no longer included in the main road segment A project plans. The bridge would have been built next to the Limehouse Bridge, helping to connect several parts of the bike ped network in that area. And obviously providing bike ped access is important for a lot of reasons. On one hand, you've got people out there now biking and walking in unsafe situations. And on the other hand, it's really the only way that we're going to be able to chip away at traffic congestion. The main road segment A project has been in progress since 2016 as part of the half cent sales tax referendum. Herbert Nims is the project manager and explained the decision to nix the bridge came after the South Carolina Department of Transportation rejected the county's request to maintain it. He says the transportation sales tax funds cannot cover the costs of maintenance, so they're evaluating other bike and pedestrian accommodations, starting with the Limehouse Bridge. We had planned on restriping that bridge to accommodate four travel lanes, so we're looking at maybe reducing that and, and including a, a bike ped path on that bridge. Charleston County Council will vote on awarding a design build contract for the main road segment A project at their meeting on Tuesday. Zimmerman planning to be there to advocate for the bridge. We can work together, figure out a funding source for maintenance or a, a different agency or entity who's willing to fund the maintenance. And tonight's county council meeting will begin at 630. Reporting in Charleston County, I'm Jordan Sayopa. Count on two.